Hey everyone, Up North Collectors here. We're breaking a 2017-18 uh, Dunross Optic Hobby Box. This is the basketball box uh, where you can get one autograph or you're guaranteed one autograph <clears throat> uh, per box. And now it says on here uh, a on-card autograph, but then it gives this little thing. Look for rated rookie. Doesn't mean you're going to get a rookie. In fact, a lot of these boxes I don't think have rookie autographs. Um, anyways, we'll see what we get here. You get 10 uh, Prism Parallels per box, uh, and it's a 200-card um, set uh, with 150 base cards and 50 rated rookie cards. Or, or rookie card, Yeah, rated rookie cards. So um, <clears throat> a lot of different parallels in this stuff, uh, numbered uh, parallels. You know, you have um, all different kind of colors, and here on the back it will show you what those are. And this is the first off the line, and so it's the Purple Stars Parallel. That's the unique one and first off the line, and it's numbered to 13. So on average, of course, you should get one of those, um, as I well as your autograph. Average, I'm pretty sure they guarantee you one. Yeah, they guarantee you one, but I read I've on the... I've seen one dude who got, like, two boxes where he did not get one. Yeah, and I read on the Panini... Um, on average. Yeah, actually yeah it does. On, on like, the it's Knight's sad. Lance thing, it said, it said, get the first off-the-line box. This is an advertisement for it when it came out, and it said, um, on average, you know, that's Panini's thing, on average. And just in case you don't get it, they just go back to the on average. So we'll see what these cards look like. The Dunross cards that came out this year, in my opinion, were a little bit on the ugly side with the bronzy look to them. These look more like the football uh, version yeah. of this, Actually, this past really year. Actually, really sleek-looking packs, one of my new favorite pack art designs. They're pretty cool-looking, kind of silver and blue. You got like Jason them. Tatum on the, on the front there. Let's so get into this. So here's the base design. Larry Nance Jr. I actually like this a little bit better than the football one. I like the little bit thicker borders. Yeah, that is. The football. Yep. I kind of like that. So, there's the base, and there's the back. The back is pretty much the same as the football ones. So, Larry Nance Jr. LeBron James. Looks like there's a parallel card here. So, Zach Randolph. And looks like an orange. Trailblazer. Joseph Nurkic. And that is going to be numbered out of 199. 113 out of 199. All right, so first nice parallel. Card. Yep, <clears throat> they're definitely nice looking. Really sweet. Actually, I, I definitely, the thicker border really brings out the color more than like the football ones. I like that. All right, next pack. Got James Harden. Pretty cool. Got LeBron James and James Harden back to back packs. Uh, Isaiah Thomas. And then we have a Chauncey Billups. And this is going to be the Retro Series. These are sweet looking too. Yeah, those are nice looking. They're kind of like a pink, uh, yeah, pink edge or, you know, some edge color on there. I think this uh, is the a silver one too. Yeah. Oh. Is it a. Thing. Does it say Prism on mm -hmm. it? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Prism right there. up there in the corner. So it is the Holo version. Sweet looking. And then a Jarrett Allen Raid rookie card. These look exactly the same as the football ones. Nice looking design. Now that's just the standard. That's not the prism or the, yeah, the, the silver. And, and this stuff is generally the third card in. is going to be something different. All right, so we got Brandon Ingram. Dwayne Wade. And a Bill Russell retro series. This is not the holo version. You can tell the other one's a little bit more silver than this. This is more white and no prism symbol up there. Then we got Jonathan Simmons base. Right next pack. Yeah, the cards are really sharp looking. They look real nice. So yeah, I, I really like these. They're nice looking. Looks like we have a rookie silver in here, so that's a pretty good one. Or. Not pretty good, or could, but a, be. could be a good one. It's good to get a rookie, a rookie silver, let's just say that. Yeah. Justin Jackson. And the rookie silver will be Luke. I think, yeah, Eric Luke Kennard. Kennard. Yep. It's not bad. Nice looking card. It says Prism down here. I don't know how much he's been doing for them. I don't, do you know? Like, I don't his know. No, I don't know how, how well he's been playing or how much he's been playing. 
Um, we tried to look up some of these are you know on eBay because there's already um, various uh, listings that have been posted from people breaking uh, some retail products that they found. Yeah, it's not the auto, but the champ is here dance rod. That's a oh, that's cool, a that's that, a cool. Looking that's answer. a really cool looking yeah. answer actually. That is that's nice looking. Um, like, yeah. Yeah. Is it does it say anything on the back? Like is it numbered or anything? No. No. It's a hustle the... guy on a handful of teams that flow deep into June. That's sweet looking. I like that answer. Yeah, that's really nice looking. That's sharp. Um, yeah. Yeah, but anyways, so the we try to find some listings on eBay with these, you know, silvers are selling for, and I don't think they're. It's, I think some of them are selling well, but I, there's not going to be any way they're going to match uh, Prism from earlier this I year. I think, but if you get a Mitchell one or a Ball or something, you can probably do pretty well. Like you make a decent amount of money back off. All right, the there's Andre Drummond, uh, DeAndre Bembre. And then here's one of these throwbacks, Dan Isel. Those are pretty cool looking. The retro series, those are cool looking. Um, and then Tyler Dorsey is our Raider rookie. What do we have? Just one number parallel so one far? One number, yep. Yeah. And then for, we have two prisms. Okay, they, two prisms. Say you get, so you get bottoms, 10. So. All right, Gordon Hayward. Right now. Brooke Lopez and another champ is here. This is Ray Allen. Ray Allen. Quite so. a few inserts in here, which is cool. And then uh, Baca. All right. So we got this first off the line. You get it a day before, at, at least um, before the actual uh, product comes out, the regular hobby boxes. They actually um, overnighted this. Yeah, to they us. actually overnighted it to us. Now this was a total pain to order. If you tried to order these online, I'm sure you can sympathize with us because it was not easy to get any of this stuff. It took over an hour for us to order it, and we did it leisurely. We weren't trying to. This is a silver of some kind. Yeah. This is a parallel. No, it's just no, a silver. It's just a silver. Wesley Matthews silver. Um, it took us a long time to get get the order um, but it did go through even when it went through we weren't really sure we got it but um, they're $85 a box uh, and that was delivered so no shipping charge on top of that so pretty good pretty good deal um, and the cards are really sharp uh, we'll see once you know what kind of value there is in this box here um, Emmanuel Mude, uh, Tim Hardaway Jr. and an all-stars uh, Draymond Green uh, so this is just an all-star insert card. That's nice looking. And then Eric Bledsoe. All right. So nothing huge yet out of this box. Ryan Anderson. Jeremy Lin. And we have a purple, looks like. Purple Dwight Howard. Is this the purple stars? Yeah, this is. is the purple stars. Okay, so purple stars. Dwight Howard, two of thirteen. That's but not a horrible one. That's not horrible. Head. No, it's uh, it's, it's hard. hard it's see. hard to see the stars. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Yeah, you can. You can see just a little bit it's, right there. You can see the stars there, but it's, it's not super obvious. In fact, at, at least first, on this card, this card has a pretty dark. Yeah, uh, has a pretty though, dark so. background, and then, um, Milos is our last. Uh, card in that pack so, yeah, so that's not a, that's not a i mean there's it's mostly with the 200 card set and only 50 of them being rookies like three quarters of the time you're gonna get yeah, a you, your chance to get a to get someone that is even like a decent name is gonna be hard so yeah it that's not bad you're right dwight howard is definitely not the worst guy you can get out of that yeah so <clears throat> next pack here we got dennis schroeder darren collison all clear for takeoff, Zach Levine or Levine. These are pretty sweet. Yeah, that's too. pretty cool looking. I'm definitely a fan of the inserts. In here. Yeah, the, I think they're cool. Excuse me, the there, inserts are like very nice. The, down here, it's hard. To, you know, you can kind of see on camera. There's like the there's somebody holding a camera. And yeah, it's like a courtside scene. Yep, that's pretty cool. All right, next pack. Got Chris Middleton, Reggie Jackson. A Magic Johnson All-Stars. This is the holo version. 
And then a Gershon Yabusele, maybe? Rookie? <laughs> maybe. That's. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I said the first name right, maybe, but the last name I have no idea. <clears throat> but so far, we haven't had any big name rookies. No, we have not. Uh, Chris Stapps Porzingis, Victor Oladipo, All Stars Paul George. And Kawhi Leonard. No, I, I don't even know what the best name is that we've hit yet. Like Jared Allen or Luke Kennard, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Get quite a few of them, though. I would imagine it wouldn't take too super long to get a set, depending on how the stuff's, you know, collated. Yeah, it, it would be a little hard to make up a set, uh, I would think, because you don't have a lot of, uh... A lot of cards. A lot of cards in here. There's uh, in, quite a few inserts. So there's a OG this Ray rookie. This going to be a green retro series. Who's that? Oscar Robertson. That's sweet looking. Actually. That is cool looking. For the Milwaukee it's like, Bucks. Is that like lime green? Lime. I think it's. I think the parallel is lime. Yeah, I think it is. Green. This is going to be numbered out of 175. It is. It's lime green. That's actually very cool looking. With the pink, the pink and the green looks awesome together. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah, that's different. It's pretty cool. Those uh, retro cards are actually quite cool. I think they did a good job with the set overall. I'm, yeah. I like it. I don't know that I like it, though, at the price point of what they're trying to sell hobby boxes for. There's another green in this pack. So we got Kevin Love, Jabari Parker, a Jordan Clarkson green. And that's also out of Is that lime again? Yeah. Weird. The lime. I think the other, like, the because I'm pretty sure they have greens to five in this stuff, too. And I think yeah, they're they, a right. lot darker. The, the, yeah, that's the standard green. So it would be a dark, dark color. All right, so we're looking for our autograph still. We got our... Purple Stars um, parallel that was guaranteed. Number to 13, the Dwight Howard. So we'll see what we have for our autograph. It would be nice to see a on card rated rookie autograph. Um, <clears throat> the veteran um, autographs in here we've seen are stickers, it looks like. At least uh, for most of them. Yeah, at least for most of them. Dwight Howard, Tobias Harris, and uh, Eric Bloodsoe Silver, and then a rated rookie, Tyler Lydon. Not so, gotten very good parallels yet. No. You said, I mean, the Dwight Howard wasn't bad, but everybody else has not been a very good name. Next pack. Uh, this is uh, Hernan, Gomez. Hernan Gomez, Sabonis, and a Clay Thompson All Stars. That's just the base, and then a Devin Booker. All right, next pack. Yeah, so for a hundred and hundred over a hundred dollars, hundred twenty-five dollars, whatever they're asking for them now, I don't know. That seems pretty pretty steep. Uh, these were eighty-five, and that seems like a good price. Um, Damari Carroll. At least for this rookie class. Yeah, Mike Conley, and then here is a pink, Rick Barry. It's not pink. It's just not pink. Retro sorry, series. it's just the retro series. It looked pink to me. It looked more pink than the other ones. I don't know why that is. Just did. All right, so two more to go. The retro series. Those are cool. I really like those. Um, saving our auto till the end. I guess it's either going to be this pack or the next. So let's see. Here's what I like to see. I like to see this be the auto, but with a Mitchell name on it. That would be nice. All right, Derek Rose. Jimmy Butler, and it does look like a blue. Dwayne Wade. Bad. All right, blue. I was thinking maybe that was the auto there. Six of 49. Well so that's the lowest numbered one besides our purple stars parallel. Close to the jersey number, too. It's the yeah. upside down Let's version. See, there's six. He's six. Now he's nine. All right, now he plays for the Heat again, Heat again right? right? Yeah. He was at the Marlins Red Sox game last night that we were watching. Yeah, so yeah, we were watching the Red Sox Marlins play, and they were showing all the big stars there. Big Poppy was there, and Dwayne Wade, and Derek and Jeter, Jeter, of course, the owns the team. So, um, you are auto is. All right, so here is the last pack. Last pack, um, Mojo, as they say. Are we gonna get a nice autograph or not? Let's find out. All right, Avery, Avery Bradley. Oh, there it is. There it like is. A yeah. So, this would be a good one to get if it's him. Fultz. Uh, Markel Fultz. All right. And so here we go, guys. 
for the rated rookie, hopefully, rated rookie autograph. Upside down. Is that Tadosic? Tadosic. <laughs> don't know much about him. I, mean, I don't know anything about him. But it's nice to get, I mean, maybe he's not the name you want to get probably, but to get a rated rookie on-card autograph is actually pretty good because we've seen some breaks that people posted online on forums, and a lot of guys have been pulling veteran autos, yeah. and they're not all the greatest guys. So to get an on-card rookie autograph, not going to complain. I, th I think this guy, I've heard a couple of things about him. I thought somebody said that he's pretty good, but I'm not sure I'll have to look him up. So Kembe Walker, um, this is a, a swishful thinking. It's the only one of those that we got. It's the only one of those we got. So... And then this Avery Bradley. So, um, yeah, I mean, I don't know if it was the greatest box. I don't think it was the worst box, but um, no. pretty average. But once again, to get the Raider rookie autograph is definitely good. And if you obviously pull the big names, you're looking at some serious money because they're on card. And one thing uh, that we find in basketball collecting is the on card autos sell way better than uh, the sticker autos. So some sports is not quite as dramatic. So there's the Dwight Howard Purple Stars. Now I can see it a little bit better, but it's really hard to it's see. It's really hard to see. So that's number to 13. So that'd be uh, obviously the lowest number parallel we got. And the 50 was the next one, or 49. Yeah, so we got Magic Johnson, Eric Bloodsoe, Luke Kennard, Chauncey Billups, and Wesley Matthews. And then for the inserts, you got a big stack of rookies and inserts and stuff. So switch with thinking. Fultz, Rab, Barry, Leiden, uh, Yusuvul, Tadosic. Giles, Allen, Dorsey, Jackson, Russell, and yeah, so the Fultz was the best rookie that we got. Yeah, Fultz was the best the rookie. Um, I definitely like the parallels. They're they're really sharp. Um, I like them better than the football ones. I yep. Think. I'd say they did a really good job uh, with the look of these cards, and I think the set overall is, is nice. Um, I'm old school guy, so I like the. I don't mind the veteran players. I'm sure some people maybe just want all the modern players, but it's kind of cool to get a um, Dennis Rodman or a Chauncey Billups or Magic Johnson in there. Um, pretty fun. So, anyways, that's it uh, for our break. It's first off the line, 2017-18. Um, you know, we uh, we ordered a couple more of these. We're not sure if we're going to break them or not, but we want to at least break one. Um, and we might be selling uh, one or two of the other ones. We'll see if we break another one. We'll try to do it on our channel and show you what we get out of uh, the other box if we open it up. But thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, we hope you are doing well. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to our channel and would like to, we greatly appreciate it. Please do. Comment below and hit the thumbs up button if you like what you saw. We uh, appreciate you all watching. And uh, to all our subscribers, a big thank you. Um, Please stay tuned for more breaks. We'll be posting more soon. Take care and have fun collecting, guys.